Ahoy pilots, this is Ty from Cloud Ahoy. When using Cloud Ahoy on an iPad, users will be presented with an interface optimized for screen size. Most of the interface elements found on your Mac or PC can be accessed through the tablet interface as well. These features are available to users of both Cloud Ahoy Pro and Cloud Ahoy Standard. The default layout is divided into two views, one containing a 3D track view and the other a segment information view. In this case, Cloud Ahoy displays the last traffic pattern's approach to land. To declutter or to move the timeline to another segment, expand the Tools pane and tap on it in the Segments Manager. Here, I declutter to display only a single traffic pattern. After tapping it in the Segments Manager, the left panel closes automatically. In Cloud Ahoy Pro, you can also tap on a segment using CFI Assistant. The buttons on the top of each view allow you to select which display type to use. For example, tapping 2D will change the left view to use 2D Track. Tap on the Options button to change the map type and add additional layers. To close a view, tap on the X button. The remaining view will now take up the full debrief area. Tap the Split button to replicate the current view. Each orientation has its own layout, stacked in portrait mode and side-by-side -side in landscape. Cloud Ahoy will remember your layout and use it the next time you debrief this flight. Using a different layout in portrait and landscape mode can be useful to get different perspectives on the same maneuver. In this instrument approach example, I can use 3D track and HUD views side by side to visualize my approach. When rotating the device to portrait mode, I can have a single view showing me the segment information where I can analyze the raw data. Finally, Cloud Ahoy supports a number of touch gestures to improve debriefing. Scrubbing the segment information view will advance the timeline forward and backwards. Drag one finger on the 2D and 3D track views to pan the camera. Finally, zoom and rotate the 3D camera using two fingers. For more information, visit help.cloudahoy.com, email team at cloudahoy.com, or click the Feedback button.